Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you some really cool voice effects that you can do inside Audacity. Check out my Audacity Ultimate Course for Beginners. If you are a podcaster, YouTuber, voiceover artist, or audio editor, you need this course. Head over to mrc.fm slash audacity. That is mrc.fm slash audacity. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. It sound right, boy. So let's take a look. I've got a voiceover recording here, and I'm going to double click to select everything in this right here. And then I'm going to go into my effect menu and start to play with this. One of my favorites out of the box is the phaser because you can do so much with it. Let's start the playback. Here are some of the coolest voice effects. So you can add that kind of alien sound. Let's focus in on this bit and start the playback. Here are some of the coolest. And of course, the more I crank up the feedback, <laughs> you get a real kind of wee 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 to that. You can turn the output gain up. Coolest voice effects. And you can change the depth and things like that and start to really play about with this until you get the sound you're looking for. Here are some of the coolest voice effects. So you can get that phased underwatery sound. It's really, really awesome. Another thing I like to do quite a bit in Audacity is add a bit of reverb, a bit of kind of roominess to my voiceovers, particularly when I'm making jingles or any kind of imaging. So that's available in effect again. And you want to go for reverb here. Now, of course, we need to select everything as usual, Control or Command A, Effect, Reverb, and then we can start to play. Let's go to the factory preset. Let's go to the default and play it back. Here are some of the coolest voice effects. Pretty good out the box. Now, we've, Here are some of the as well as this possibility, got other great presets like Vocal One. Here are some of the coolest voice effects. I like that because that's quite a, quite a subtle one. We've also got Vocal Two as well. Let's preview that. Here are some of the coolest voice effects. And if you only want to get the reverb, click wet only, and you'll get just that kind of room echo. Here are some of the coolest voices. So you can hear what you're working with. Now, you can, of course, change all of these. If you want to make it so that it's like bigger and roomier, increase the room size. If you want a bigger reverb, increase that. You can change the wet gain, which is the sound of the reverb, or the dry gain, the sound of the voiceover, make that louder, and the stereo width to make that reverb nice and stereo. And the final effect I'm going to show you is chorus. Now, in Audacity, if you go to the effect menu, there is no chorus effect. Well, not that I can see anyway. It's something I love doing with audio, so let me show you how to do it easily in Audacity. First, I'm going to take this voiceover, hit Control or Command C and copy it. And then I'm going to go to Tracks and I'm going to add a new stereo track. And I'm going to do the same again, Tracks, and then add new stereo track. And what I'm going to do now is just paste that voiceover and then use this, the Time Shift tool, to just shift these slightly out of sync with each other and play back. Here's Here's some cool okay, that's probably a little too shifted. So let's actually zoom right in and get just a slight we only want to do milliseconds apart that's literally all we want to do here are some of the coolest voice effects so that sounds pretty chorusy but it's not very stereo that's a mono effect so all i need to do now is take these two separate tracks pan one to the left 100 percent one to the right 100 percent here are some of the coolest voice effects inside Audacity. And you've got yourself a really cool chorus with just a few extra processes to go through there uh, inside Audacity. Did I miss something out? Anything you want to see in a future video, let me know in the comments down below. If you're creating an online radio show, podcast, radio imaging, or simply want to make your voice sound different, you must get hold of my Audacity presets. Head over to mrc.fm forward slash presets. Go and get them now at mrc.fm forward slash presets. Thumbs up! Subscribe for more! Music Radio Creative.com